Okay, let's move back to part two. Oh, this is over here. Okay, so now we go. Nice. Oh, it's you. Okay. So we <laughs> we'll just spread the. Were we thinking the Sandman was snuck in or something? Yeah, y'all see our hands over there? I'm like, ooh. <laughs> Look, our pasta rested, so now the gluten is nice and relaxed. We'll be able to roll it in the roller. Mm -hmm. No problem. Now, how do they make things gluten free? Anything without flour. So gluten's in the the wheat that you want to go grow mm -hmm. that has gluten in it. Once it's but the rice flour and the other flour doesn't have like corn flour and all that doesn't have. Shouldn't have it. Yeah, as long as it doesn't have contain wheat, you'll be good with gluten. Long, okay. As long as it's not like an additive or like this flour is an added so in there. So semolina. That might not be. I think that's just that's a finer version of this. Oh, okay. Yeah, so that has gluten. Yeah. Because they, they use that a lot in pasta. Because there's so many, I didn't realize I was reading something the other day, and there were so many different flowers now as opposed to years ago when there was wheat, and then there was the brown wheat and the white wheat, white wheat yeah. and then there was... Um, we're just going to cut it in half because it's going to be super long once you see. Yeah, I know. I was about to roll the whole thing. I was like, hold up. Cut it in half. Then you're going to flatten it out that way. Once you put it in the roller, it'll fit. Mm -hmm. down just a little bit. There you go. Want more of that? Let's see. I think it's off. It was. <laughs> there you go. That was cut. Thank you. Mm-hmm. And you can see that dividers. That's nice. Nice mm -hmm. and thick. That extra flour that we had, you can drizzle it on top. That way it won't stick. Once you get a pasta roller, we'll start at seven because that's the biggest one and that'll fit fit this thick pasta. Okay. So that's the one I meant to ask you before. So it's just different sizes then? Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, this little gauge right here, it has different gears. So on mine, seven's the biggest. Or the largest, and that's what, how you start it off. Then you go from your largest all the way down to your smallest, or however thin or thick you want your pasta. You went from that mm -hmm. to that. It's, okay. Yeah, that's still real thick though, so we're gonna go set seven. Now, if you want to roll it, let me know. No, oh, well, I'll do this, this one. There we go. So, oatmeal flour. What can you do with that? Oatmeal flour? Oh, wow, yeah. I'd probably put that in cake. Oatmeal. I know almond meal you, you do. Almond flour. Oat flour. Yeah, maybe like smoothies. I guess so. I don't know. Thickness. Yeah, probably for a thickness because I can't see a, you baking. Well, yeah, I Cooking. guess oatmeal bread, yeah. Maybe bread or maybe like a certain stews, maybe. I mean, because it just seems like it just kind of pop because they have oat milk now. Yeah. Okay, and then they have almond milk. So it, it just seems like almond flour has been around for quite a while, but mm -hmm. it just seems like oat flour just popped up out of nowhere because I know, but I mean, I can't say that I, I, I never heard of it like I'm the expert, but. No, 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 I hear you. Yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe. Yeah, thicken stuff up. Oatmeal, probably. Yeah. That'll be good for that if you didn't want like the real oatmeal. Well, I have oatmeal every day now, so. Oh, good. Cinnamon or uh, maple. Oh yeah. yeah. My friend just um bought a farm in um Maine. Everybody's from Maine, okay. She's not she's from here. Oh nice. I met her here. Now that's my neck of the woods, but she Dang. bought a farm. So she's got chickens and she's got four maple trees. I'm like, when you make that maple syrup, 
Yeah, oh, she better send some of this way. I told her. Yeah, come on here. Now it's getting longer. Yeah. Right now we're at four. Okay. So you put the nozzle down lower and lower every time you get ready to send it through. Yeah. So if it, like, say, say you had an air bubble or something, or okay. didn't, you could always put it back through on the same number. Then it going to hurt nothing. And while it's going, we'll pull it out. Oh, good, okay, good. Man. I like to go down to three because four is still a little too thick. All right. But right before we do that, you know, you, you got a good, good thickness, good width. It's not too long. It's not. Yeah. It's not going to mess. Sometimes it'll be well, too Well, that's on my to-do list. I'm going to buy one of those. But like I said, there were other things we needed to do, so. Oh, yeah. A oh, bath and body? Yeah, back. Bath and body works? No. Out? What's the other one? Bed Bath Beyond. Okay. <laughs> one of those bed places. Yeah, that's where I got this one from. It was like eight years, six. It's been years since I had bought this. Oh, they might not even have any. That, or they might have a better version. Who knows? There we go, y'all. So she went from this little block to all this pasta right here, nice and thin. I stopped this one at three, just so you can. Okay. Bam. You want fettuccine first? Whatever you do, whatever you do, I'll do the follow up. Yeah, DD. Looks like a necktie. <laughs> Is it? You want to wear it? <laughs> no, I don't think I want to wear it. You sure? Hey, you could use it. Well, no, you want to do this? You want one long? I could get up and get a knife, couldn't I? That's all right. I'm going to make this work. Let me see that. Okay. Now that's the fettuccine or that's the spaghetti? This one's going to be fettuccine. Okay. So. We'll put it in there the same way. Noodles. That is so cool. Hey. All it took was eggs, flour, salt, and oil. Really? That's not a bad thing. Mm -mm. And you get all this pasta. So you could actually make a whole bunch of pasta ahead. But now we have to keep, you told me to keep it in the freezer, right? The last time. Yeah, that's why I put mine. So what happens with the ones that you get that you can store on the glass? The they ones from the I, the ones from like the stores, I think they put something like they must put some preservative in it. Yeah. yeah. I, I know certain like real Italians they'll be able to do this and they'll let it dry. Yeah. They'll leave it out no problem. But I'm not even that good yet. Eventually. You good. So I got you on spaghetti. Okay. Oh, never mind. Come on the spaghetti drill. Okay. After we flatten it. Another look all over for it. Okay, so now I gotta flatten it, right? Uh -huh. That is so nice. Yeah, we did good, girl. Yeah. I'm just flatten it like this. Mm -hmm. I remember some of it. That way you can get that little corner put in there, and that should be good. Okay, so we'll put it in here. This is on seven. Oh, no, it's not. Now you are. See it? And that one might be a little wobbly. Let's see. See that? That's one of those right here. There you go. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, 
ですけどね Okay, muscles. <laughs> Perfect. So I pull it out the thing. Yeah, yeah. You see where it goes? I think. Here, right? Yeah. Yeah, I got it. Nice. Now you just, you just you turn it up, turn it down a lot. Yep. And watch, yeah, watch my fingers. That thing. Yeah, I don't necessarily want to put my fingers through. But this reminds me of the washing machine we used to have when I was little. <laughs> oh, up there spinning it. Mm. And my mother told me, don't put your hands in there. <laughs> okay. And so I didn't listen to her. I put my hand in there. Got you good, didn't it? Oh, yeah, I got my hand stuck in there washing the ringer. <laughs> I think every kid did who grew up with a washing machine like that got their hand stuck in the ringer. It was just one of those things. Yeah. It was. I wasn't by myself. I wasn't alone with that. Because mm -hmm. I've heard other people who are my oh, age, no. hmm? yeah, of course, my age say that. And you gonna turn it down or not today? Uh huh. I think you got it like that. You see, I was going from one. Yeah. An easy way to fix it would have fold it in three, flatten it down again. Okay. I'm gonna put you back up. That way, when it comes out. Okay. Stay. The front side, long way. Yeah. And since it's not not like bread, it's not gonna <laughs> not gonna get stuck. This thing keeps going out. You break it to black. No. <laughs> no, right, done. Yeah. Let me stop. So now you're on seven, six. It's just so we can move it around and all that. I still have to learn how to spin to it. Yeah, but if you want to make Irish cream, come over and I'll trade you. I'll teach you that. Definitely, bro. Okay. So now it's on four. Yes. Oh. I don't know why this is not going. Killing it. Hmm? She over here killing it. 
seat you feel kind of stiff. Yeah. Yeah. So the Italians now when they do it, do they bake their pasta or do they make pasta fresh all the time? They, they make it fresh all the time, almost every day probably. Yeah. Because I figured they must have some kind of preservative in it to make it last. Mm, plus, some of their, a lot of their ingredients are like made fresh every day. They just get it from the market. Yeah. Okay. Oh, that's the last one? Uh-huh. I'll get you a knife this time. Get the knife. Oh, you got me perfect. Pretty good amount, yeah. It'll last what? Mm -hmm. A good couple months. Well, the last one will be made. I still have the other set of kini that they want. Oh, nice. I only did a few more for the rest of them. Yeah. Here's the other one. Perfect. Now for your spaghetti one, you gonna stick this in here? Uh huh. This one, I think right where my fingers at. Yeah. Mm hmm. Yeah. 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 I know. But you can't, you know, like get it in there and keep it in there, so. Right. Mm -hmm. I always have my hair down here to sit so it doesn't fall. Perfect. And got spaghetti. Okay. Yeah. Even though it folded over, you're still good. I mean, nobody's really going to know. They're going to say, oh, you just folded the spaghetti over. <laughs> I'm selling the teacher. <laughs> That's what you made. Yeah, spaghetti. Now, now, give it a good feel. That stuff is like angel hair. Yeah. Mm hmm That's nice. Yeah, nice and long, too. Mm hmm Go ahead. And we have pasta. Anything you want to say to them before we go off? All right, thanks for watching, Woodard. This one will take about like two minutes. Yeah.
her porridge in like two, three minutes to cook in the water, and they're good. Chef Jasmine does it again. Chef Didi. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Look here. In my other life. Oh, uh -huh. you should see this lady now. Oh, yeah, cooking it up. I'm going to sing it. This is the part we hate. <laughs> Did I lose? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to get right out the way. Okay, let me get a couple of them this off. Thanks for watching. We enjoyed your company. We hope you enjoyed ours. Yes, we did. Come back and visit when she teaches me how to make that Irish thing. Oh, yes. Uh-huh. Oh, yes. Which will be in a couple of weeks because it's almost the holidays. Mm -hmm. So we don't really need an excuse now, do we? No. Bye, everybody. <laughs> I love you. Take care. God bless. Stay safe. Bye-bye.